What's up guys and welcome back to the channel and in this video I'm going to show you how you can mine dogecoin on Linux and make yourself some money. So the first thing that you're going to do is you're going to go to xmrig.com and download the xmrig. I'm using Ubuntu 20.04 so we'll go ahead and download that. And then once you've downloaded that you're going to want to go into the downloads folder in the command line and you'll see that we have a .tar.gz file. And so to extract that, we're just going to type tar xvzf and then tab, and that'll extract the tar.gz file. And now that we have that extracted, we need to download a wallet. You can go to dogecoin.com slash wallet to find different wallets that you can use. The wallet that I'm going to be using is the uh, Doge Wallet Desktop by Doge Party XDP. It works pretty good. So I'm going to download the 64-bit version. All right, cool. So now that that's done downloading, what we need to do is we need to extract the uh, tar gz file for the doge wallet .linux64, and we can do that by running the same command we just ran: tar xbzf, and then doge wallet. And now that it's all extracted, we'll just go into the doge wallet directory and we'll install the wallet. And we can do that by typing sudo slash install sh. Awesome, and now that the installation is complete, we can run Doge Wallet to create a wallet for our Dogecoin. So we'll type dot slash Doge Wallet. Click Create New Wallet. And you're going to want to write this down. I'm not really going to write it down anywhere because this is just for an example. You'll, this is very important. You're definitely going to want to keep this. So for the sake of simplicity, I'm just going to open gedit and paste it in here and minimize it. All right, now that we have our wallet made and that you, that you have the uh, phrase saved, your seed phrase, we can view our address by clicking up in this top right corner, view address. And there's our Dogecoin address and we're gonna need that later. So we'll go ahead and minimize this for now and I'll open up a new instance of the terminal emulator. All right, so now what we're going to need to do is we need to find a mining pool for Dogecoin. You can find one at www.unminable.com coins, and all you have to do is search Doge. And now once we're inside of here, we're going to click Random X, because that's the type of mine that we're using. And this is going to be our mining pool. And we're going to just click here and copy that. Now that we've copied it, we need to edit a configuration file for our XM rig so that it uses that mining pool. So we'll go into our downloads XM rig folder and we're going to type gedit config.json. And now we're going to edit this configuration file to send the cryptocurrency to our wallet and to use our crypto mining pool. And I'll show you how to do that. So Right here on line 65, you see URL and user. The user is your wallet address. You don't really need a password. And the URL is the URL for our mining rig. And we're just gonna press Control V. And it, if you look on here, you can actually see the port 3333. And that's the port that we're gonna use. So port 3333. And then under user, we need our wallet address. Here's where things will get a little bit specific. Since we're mining Dogecoin, we need to type doge colon and then our wallet address. So we can go back in here, copy our wallet address, and paste it right here. And now the only thing that we have to do is we have to put a nickname to our wallet address on the mining pool. And we can do that by typing period and then the nickname. So I'll make the nickname my example. Save this. And now we're done with the config.json file, so we can go ahead and close it. Okay, now that we're done editing the config.json file, all we need to do is run the xmrig. And we can do that by typing sudo dot slash xmrig. enter your password. So you'll get some output. Eventually, 
it'll display your hash rate and then you'll know that you're mining dogecoin on the mining pool all right and see how it says new job from rx unminable 333 that means that we are mining on the mining pool and if you press h in xm rig you can see your current hash rate you can see mine right now is 374.7 hashes per second okay so i went ahead and stopped the mining rig because i'm recording my screen and it would probably cause a lot of lag if i were to go ahead and show you this as i was mining but if you wanted to confirm whether or not you are mining dogecoin correctly to your wallet here's how you're going to do it and you're going to definitely want to do this on the unminable page where we got our mining pool from you're going to want to copy the address of your doge wallet which i believe i already have copied anyway and paste it in here and you can search on this mining pool whether or not you are mining now nothing is going to come up for mine because i closed it before it actually had any real work done in the mining pool Generally speaking, you're going to need to earn a certain amount of Dogecoin before you can cash out because anytime you send or cryptocurrencies, it, there is a fee. I believe on here, the balance that you need to have is 30 Dogecoin in order to cash out. All right, and so that was a quick tutorial on how you can mine Dogecoin on any Linux system. And to, to recap what we did, we downloaded XM Rig, then we downloaded a Dogecoin wallet, and the one that we used was Doge Wallet by Doge Party XDP. And then we found a mining pool, and we connected our mining pool and a new Dogecoin wallet to the configuration file in the XM Rig folder that is config.json. And I hope that helped, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching.